this is your girl, Twyla Cole, a.k.a. Sister Cole, and I'm getting ready to make some smothered turkey necks come with it. Yes, I'm coming with it, baby. So, you know what I need you to do? I need you to subscribe to my page, hit like and share, all right? And make sure you definitely hit that notification bell so that you can get notifications when I'm on. Let's get into it, honey. Okay, so here are the turkey necks. Um, I have washed them very clean. I've washed them off with vinegar and salt. And of course, I have clean hands because there's no dirty hands in Sister Cole's kitchen. So I'm gonna be using onions. This is an orange um, pepper and scallion. So that's what I'm going to use um, as my seasoning for my turkey necks. Now, a lot of people use celery. And like I said, it's your kitchen, you do what you want. But listen to me, I know how to make food taste real good and I understand them flavors. So I chose the onion, the orange pepper, and the scallion. You see what I'm saying? No, you won't see what I'm saying. Now get into it, baby. And my dries that I'm gonna use, I'm gonna use paprika for color because it don't have no taste. I keep telling y'all, but that's for color. I'm gonna use good old garlic pepper. I'm gonna use um, some onion uh, flavor, and I'm gonna use good old Maggie all-purpose seasoning, okay? And, I'm gonna, and I might add some little lorries in there, okay, and some black pepper as well. Yes, I think I'll add little lorries in there because I'm giving it a flavor, you understand? I don't want no regular daggler turkey necks. I need my turkey necks to be flavored and with color because I done already told y'all, Sister Cole don't have no big old white piece of meat sitting up on a plate. No, baby, presentation is important, important. So it has to have color as well, you understand? It has to look good on the plate as well as eat good. All right, so you still with me? Come on, let's get into it, baby. Here's the pepper. I'm going to be adding pepper as well. All right, so I have mixed my seasonings in um, with the turkey necks. And I'm also going to add a little salt, just a little bit of salt, okay? Now, remember, you add as much seasoning, you know, as you want. You got to kind of know how, but every family is different. You gauge it to the way you want it. You know, some people want less sodium, less salt. And, it, you know, you substitute it whichever way you want. But this is how I do it in my kitchen. All right, I got my good old Dutch pot. And I have oil in the Dutch pot because I'm getting ready to do what? I'm getting ready to brown or saute my vegetables and my turkey necks. Because I don't like no big white looking piece of meat on my plate. So I'm going to brown my meat first. This is how we're doing it. Okay, I added in my vegetables. All right, and I'm going to stir fry these, all right, on medium heat. All right, guys, I'm going to also throw a piece of thyme in there as well. I'm going to throw a piece of thyme. I love thyme. It gives your food such a good flavor. Okay, I have added the turkey wing, the turkey neck inside of the pot so that they can brown, okay? So I'm not cooking them, I am browning them. I just want you to see the color on the meat. See? That paprika gave it a nice reddish color, all right? It's going to be so good, you guys, I'm telling you. And I know, I know, I know, I know, everybody don't make their turkey necks like this you understand but that's why i'm unique that's why i'm different and that's why these necks are going to be slamming all right so i took my turkey wings out of my out of my pot and i put it right here all right now watch the flex watch what i'm about to do okay are you guys watching now here goes my pot look i want to add some water in this pot I know you ain't never seen nothing like this. I know you haven't. So sit down in class, my people. And I'm gonna add a little bit more water. Okay, just put it all in there. All right, so that was about a cup of water. Okay, so I'm gonna stir. All right. 
Okay, I added like three tablespoons of flour. So I'm gonna stir it, make sure that flour taste gets out of it, make it nice and smooth. I added a teaspoon of um, of the seasonings in there, you know, the onion, <clears throat> salt, the onion powder, the garlic, the um, and the lorries, and the Maggie all seasoning. So I added a little bit inside of the gravy, just a teaspoon of each. Get into it, honey. So then I put the gravy. I poured it over top of the. Um, over top of my turkey necks, and now I'm gonna set it into the oven and I'm gonna let it cook for about 45 minutes, 45 to an hour, please. You know what, I, I, I'm speechless. When I tell you that this already tastes good, please believe me, please believe me. I already told y'all Sister Cole ain't come to play, but she only comes to slay. Get into it, honey. <laughs> 